Look at that drag! Hello everyone, I'm going to be starting a new series this week, and this series is probably going to take quite some time to finish. I am going to be getting the trimmed completionist cape, but not necessarily in a way that most people have before. I'm going to be getting the requirements for the trimmed first, then the requirements for just the regular completionist cape, and then finally getting the max cape that I'm actually very close to getting myself right now. The reason I'm kind of doing this is because I I enjoy RuneScape, and I feel like once I get the Max Cape, it's going to be just a little closer to having the game finally completed. And also, I can't really necessarily think of somebody who has gotten the requirements in such a backwards order and then skipped from a 90s all the way to a trimmed comp. I'm not talking about people who, like, on the day of release went and got the best capes and all that. I'm, I'm talking about somebody who actually like worked, had to work for it after, you know, the release. I'm not quite sure of anybody else who's done it this way. So I'm going to post update videos on when I have completed some of the requirements. I'm not necessarily going to be like, oh, yeah, I uh, I did one game of Castle Wars. I'm, I'm one game closer. <laughs> no, I'm talking about like milestones, like 500 games and you get the, the one cape. And then obviously there's the, I think it's like 2,500 or 3,000, and then there's the 5,000. So like those would be good milestones, or, you know, so this is just kind of like the intro first episode. So the way, the way I'm going to do this is I'm going to just go through cape by cape. So as of right now, I'm only going to be showing the trimmed requirements, and those I will be getting first. So on the left side of the screen, are the requirements that I have thankfully finished already. In the middle are the ones I have started, and the ones on the right I have yet to start, or I actually don't even have the requirements. I don't even have a quest cape. I don't like questing. I'm like like 30 quest points from a quest cape. I mean, I did enough to kill tormented demons, and I was like, thanks, I'm good. Goodbye. <laughs> so... In a nutshell, I am going to be getting a comp cape all at once, trimmed. This series will actually be replacing my Sunday update videos. I wasn't necessarily a huge fan of making those. They, it's kind of like trying to like trying to summarize like two whole weeks of RuneScape gameplay in five minutes is just uncomprehendable. Like I, I couldn't even tell you like the 15 hours I play a day what what I did in five minutes. I mean, unless it was something like castle wars for 15 hours and got like 20 games or whatever done there are 30 games then like it's it's just not going to be that fun so when i do take off certain requirements i will say like i will update you and like what i've done and if there were some statistics that i'd like to share doing that then doing that you know it's just i feel like this would be a nice way for me to enjoy the last bits of uh content on RuneScape. I've pretty much done most of the stuff. I have over 500 days in game. It's it'll be fun vlogging my uh, last bit of adventures with uh, you guys. So if you enjoy this that's great. If you don't enjoy it then I don't know why you're still here watching it. Just go. <laughs> now if you do want to hang out with me maybe play some games of Castle Wars, do some stuff that you know we both need for whatever maybe do a quest together or something i don't know <laughs> the um i should always be in my friends chat if i am available to chat now there might be some times when i'm in there and i actually have it set to off because i'm recording i'm friendly the uh the only thing that might set me back a little bit is i am a full-time college student so sometimes i don't necessarily get all the time in the world to know life as much as i would like to like for example, this week I did want to post some guides that I just I just didn't have time to do. This, you know, there's not enough time in the day. But luckily, with a lot of these requirements that I will have to get, there is about 83 days of playtime at Castle Wars for the trimmed completion escape. So when I have homework and I just can't talk and I can only AFK, I feel like it's going to be kind of easy on my half for the uh, some of the requirements for uh, the trimmed comp. I don't mind spending two, three months AFK at Castle Wars. You know, it's 
it's no biggie to me. It's like whatever. It's it's fun. I get some hybrid helms, you know. Time is a slight constriction for me. So I will try my best to get a lot of skill guides out and still make these videos. This is not going to be the bulk of my time. It's just going to be me vlogging my last bit of adventures on RuneScape that <laughs> might actually take me a year or so to do. But, you know, I'll just post videos whenever I knock off a requirement or two. So I would like to thank you guys for watching my video. And if you would like to support me, all I really need is like a comment saying, keep up the good work. That's all I need. I don't need money. I don't need fame. This is just a fun outlet for me. So I'd like to thank you guys for watching this video and have a great day.